Good evening, this is Matt. Uh, we are continuing our series on the conduction system of the heart. And today we are going to present the his Purkinje system. And this will be a very basic overview because the his Purkinje system uh, has a, a significant role in ventricular tachycardia and ventricular arrhythmias. And that is a topic unto itself and beyond the scope of this presentation that I'm doing on the conduction system. So essentially, we'll just go over the basics and we will again return to anatomy. And this is the arrhythmia compendium number two. Again, Professor, uh, Professor Sesto from the University of Mannheim in Germany near Heidelberg, directly on the Rhine. If you want to take a nice boat ride, you can go right past it. So, anyways, this is our topic for today. If we follow down from the Oberfläche EKG, once again, our German lesson, surface EKG, uh, down to the SA node or the sinus, uh, sinus knoten, then the Vorhof uh, Kammer Musculatur, and that is the atrial muscle, the AV node, or the ophthalmoknoten, and you can follow over to the heart and see exactly where those are. And then we come down next to the His Bundelstamm, and that is the His Purkinje uh, system. Uh, down below is the Purkinje fasern, or the Purkinje uh, fibers. So. As I mentioned early on in the overview, uh, we go from uh, the bundle of his down to the fibers uh, or the branches as they're called. And these play an essential electrical uh, pathway for both the right ventricle and the left ventricle. And uh, if there are disturbances in that pathway, for instance, if you have a right-sided uh, heart attack, there may be abnormalities in the EKG, which could include a right bundle branch block. And that essentially comes about because there is a delay in the transmission of the electrical signal through the right side of the heart due to the fact that some of the myocardium has died and no longer transmits uh, electricity. So another pathway has to be found and that pathway takes more time and therefore the time to transmit the electricity through the right side of the heart or through the right ventricle is longer and that's how you end up with a right bundle branch block. That can also happen to the left side if you have uh, tissue or myocardium that dies on the left side of the heart or uh, that is part of the left ventricular wall. So anyways, that is essentially the anatomy of the his Purkinje system. And again, uh, there will be uh, very specialized presentations on electrophysiology. And uh, at that time, we will go into greater depth about um, the role of the his Purkinje system in ventricular arrhythmias. And uh, we will next be talking about the last part of the conduction system where the signal reaches the myocardium of the heart and the, the final depolarization and repolarization of the myocardium and what exactly takes place at that time. And that's it. Have a very good day.